In 2009-2010, UT made the postseason for the third straight year and enjoyed its best conference season, 10 wins, since 2005. The challenge for this season, replace two starters who combined for nearly 20 points per game and usher in seven newcomers without a hitch. I expect and we will see this team be very scrappy, work hard. Uh, we don't have a lot of depth. We don't have a lot of size. So we're going to have to be quick and have the attack mindset. Uh, I think, you know, I expect us to run and to press more than we ever have. So it's going to be an exciting team to watch. And, um, you know, I feel really good about our chances. Uh, this conference is so difficult, but I feel really good about where we are and where we're heading. As upperclassmen, we try to, you know, set a good example and lead by example when we step out in the drills and just talk to them while they're on the sidelines if they don't know what they're doing and just help them out because when you're young you do need guidance and you know you need somebody to be there to tell you okay this is how it's going to be so you know so you're not in shock when it happens but they have very high energy and they're really excited to start playing and I think it's going to be a fun year. UT has played a strong schedule and sits at 6-3 and three overall those losses coming to Stanford, Michigan State, and Tennessee, all of whom were ranked. They have two more tournaments on the schedule, the Basketball Travelers Classic in Las Vegas and the Maggie Dixon Surf and Slam Classic in San Diego. Ashley Fontenette and Kat Nash are the two top scorers for the Longhorns. They're combining for an average of more than 30 points per game. Gosson Kors says both are the anchors of this year's team. Kat's, she's the steady one. You know, some are more explosive, high energy, but she's somebody you can always count on. And um, she does a little bit of everything. I mean, she's our best three-point shooter. She's also our best returning rebounder. Um, and she plays inside and she plays outside. So people are going to see her play really all five positions. So she's got great versatility, steadiness that you need. You know, there are a lot of times you go through adversity during a game, during a season, but she's always the steady one for our team that keeps us on track. I think Ashley Fontenet in particular is, is an extremely explosive point guard, um, both offensively and defensively. I think she's one of the best guards defensively in the league and also uh, offensively, she's a great three-point shooter, but she also, I, I think she's got one of the best first steps to the basket and get, can get to the basket on just about anybody really in the country. UT opens Big 12 play on January 8th at Missouri. For BigTwelveSports.com, I'm Brian Mortensen.